Hello folks, uh, today I'm going after the Hamburger Galaxy. We, we've had some really windy and cloudy nights lately, so it's, it's been hard to get out. But lately, uh, when I have gotten a chance to get out here and there, I've been playing around with plate solving, and I think I finally ironed out all of the kinks. I, I think it's running the way it's supposed to now. And if I look at this latest story, I'm, I was just outside, I'm sniffling as usual. Uh, if I go to medium here, you can see it, it put my my uh, galaxy dead center. So plate solving did what it was supposed to do. Now the one thing I didn't like with the plate solving is that it, it doesn't really seem to move my mount when it's parked. I had to start my mount tracking. I went to one star, I did a one star alignment, got it tracking, and then plate solving kicked in and found my, my galaxy. The that I was looking for. I'd, I'd like to not have to even do a one-star alignment for this to work. So maybe there's still more I need to figure out. Uh, let's take a look at my guiding. A uh, guiding is absolutely terrible, but that's not even. I'm not even worried about that today. I was just playing around with plate solving, and it, it's breezy out there as usual. And oh, holy crap! Look at this. I think it's doing a meridian flip. I'm going to look out the window. I don't see nothing happening. I don't know what's going on here. Oh, it's stopping the auto guider. I'm looking out the window again. Yep, my mount is moving. I can't believe that. We just caught an automatic meridian flip. Well, I'm going to stop the video here, and I'll let you know how this turns out. I'll see you later. Hey, everyone. I am back, and my automatic meridian flip went without a hitch. Um, you can see the galaxy is dead center again. My guiding resumed. And um, it's possible my guiding isn't very good because it, the stars here look a little bit blurry. I, I probably should have refocused my uh, guide camera. I can probably go out and do that. So, But I just want to let you know everything looked good. I can't believe it. That's the first time I did an automatic Meridian flip with this plate solving. Very cool. So I'm going to stack a few images now and see how it's looking. The, the only question for me now is... I did my stars remain in focus. Uh, that's a lot of movement for my SCT. And I've been looking right now at an automatic focuser, so I don't have to worry about that all the time. So I'll see you later. Hey, I am back and I have stacked the first six images that came through. And I had to pause all the action for now. The clouds came back in. And and despite my bad guiding, it the, the stars don't look that bad. They, they look mostly round in the center. I can't complain about that. And uh, the Hamburger Galaxy, this is actually part of the Leo triplet, but with my SCT, I think it'd be better <laughs> to do one galaxy at a time, because uh, otherwise I'd probably have to go all the way to the edge with the galaxy and my stars. With this telescope, don't really look that great on the edge. So that's, that's what I got so far. I'm hoping I can get at least an hour on this galaxy today, at least with luminance and continue RGB on the next clear night, whatever that may be. That's all I got for now. I'll see you later. Hey, I am back again. I refocused my guide camera, and uh, my, my guiding has steadily improved, and that usually happens as the night goes on. I'm, I'm not sure why that is. But it's a lot better than it was. All right. That's all I got for now. I'll see you later. Hey, folks. I am back again. My galaxy was getting a little bit too low and getting close to my neighbor's backyard light. So I switched to a, a target higher up. And that's M53. And 
I did this all from inside the house, plate solving, work like a charm, restarts guiding, everything is great. I love this. It's fantastic. So I don't know how long my batteries will go. I've still got some clear skies out there. And maybe I can even get enough of this object where the next time I'm out, I'll do RGB on this one and on my galaxy and get the full color going. Okay, I'm going to stack a few of these and see how they look. I'll see you later. Hey, I am back again, and I am like a kid in a candy store. It's about 3.30 a.m., and I wanted to try yet another new target. And it's so late, the elephant trunk is back in view. So uh, let's take a look. I'm capturing with my, this one with my HA filter. And there it is. I think I'm going to capture about an hour's worth of this data and uh, just call it quits for the night. Boy, I love plate solving. Never have to leave the house. I can just point to any object I want to and there goes my telescope. Oh, I'm sorry I waited so long to get this working. So fun. All right. That's all I got. I'll see you later.